back to Devoted to Disney Down Under. Now today, I'm here with Andrew. He is here. Hello. He's hiding behind our massive shipment of New York Comic Con exclusive pop vinyls. Yay! Now we're waiting for all of them to arrive. We ordered them from three different stores and we're going to show you them today. So let's put some of these boxes on the floor so that we can find Andrew. Hello! Now, most of this merch is just New York Comic Con. There may be one or two sneaky pop vinyls in there that we popped in there just because that was super awesome and available on the same day. Yes. So, without further ado, let's crack, crack on, on into it. it. I've been waiting for this for weeks. I've actually had them for a couple of days, but I've been a little under the weather, so we had to wait till like a little better. And Andrew was like on the phone at work, we will do that video tonight. I want my pop vinyls. So which one should we start with? I think this one's from Ozzy. Then we have two from Zing and one from Pop Culture. We'll start with the Ozzy one. So the Ozzy? Okay. I have trusty scissors. Here you go. Now we did manage to get most of the pop vinyls. Well, pretty much all the ones we wanted that there were, were available. There were a few that were the convention only. So I wasn't able to get, obviously, the Mickey. Um, the rides one, mm. but who knows? Been pretty lucky in getting the others. Yep. But time will tell whether we are able to locate that. Well, one. you might have another grail oh. sale. Well, hopefully this time when we're not on holiday, we might have some money to spend. Okay. Oh, lots of paper. Lots of paper. Get rid of the paper. Oh, there's fun code goodness in here. Okay, you want to pull one out? I'll uh, pull one out. Try and move the box a bit so we can show you guys. Oh, it is Treehouse of Horrors, Mr. Burns. Oh, that's one of Andrew's choices. Not that I don't like The Simpsons, I just don't collect it. I do like, I like these uh, Treehouse of Horror ones, they're fantastic. I got the uh, Aliens from San Diego Comic Con. That's pretty cool. Okay, and the next one we have is another one for Andrew, and it is DC Superheroes Huntress. I don't think there is many for you. No, um, there's not. Show the artwork on the back. That's yeah, the back cool. is pretty cool. I like the pop vinyls when they do the fancy artwork on the back. We've got a few. Yeah. I noticed DC are bringing out, well, they're bringing out one DC character per con in a one off box. Good. Next one. Oh, it's a Stranger Things one. It is Susie. I think that's Dustin's girlfriend. It is. They sing that song. Never ending story which drives our daughter up the wall. Yes. I do dabble a little bit in Stranger Things. I love the show, but... I think if I was going to collect another complete series of pop vinyls, it would be Stranger, Stranger Things. Things yeah. So I do like it. So we, do we pick up the convention ones, don't we? Some of the others you can get. I do have all the Ghostbusters ones because that was. Next we have... It's a Disney one and it is Donald Duck. Yay! Donald. How cool is that? It's like firefighter Donald. He's again got a special back. You need to get the original Donald? Well, maybe my husband will buy it for me one day. That's a lot of money. So that's super cool. Loving the Disney pops. Nice. Don't know where I'm going to put them all, but I love them. Oh, we have Harry Potter, Filch, and Mrs. Norris. Now that is a cool pop. I'm surprised that they hadn't had him already, since he's in all of them pretty much. Sorry, not meaning to block Andrew out with the pop vinyls. Just I the am best, here. best place to get without oh, no. the glare. So next we have. Evil groundskeeper Willie from the Simpsons Treehouse of Horrors. That's a pretty cool pop. The ones on the back. Show the ones on the back. So we've got Panther Marge, Flyboy Bart, Demon Lisa, King Homer, and Alien Maggie. We'll have to chase all, all them down. Yeah, they're yeah. pretty cool. I think Pop Pop should do some pretty good deals if you buy the bundle. Yeah. We'll just have to do that one week. We have, oh, Yay. Stan Lee from the Guardians of the Galaxy. We do have a couple of Stan Lee pops. Well, that's our second, I think. Second. I am looking forward to trying to get the Stan Lee Marvel Legends that was announced. Yeah. That's going to be cool. 
Here we get go. yourself a pre-order on Zoom. We'll have to get it. There's Mr. Stanley. Rest in peace. It's pretty sad we won't see him in the movies anymore. We have Benson! Toy Story 4, yay! He that was, was a, a cool character. character. And I liked him. He was, he was really cool. We do have a lot of the Toy Story Pops. I think you pretty much got them all. I, I know I got all the exclusives. Um, and then our wonderful son Valentine actually got, you a few. got me quite a few of them as little gifts. And next we have <gasps> Sand Trooper from Star Wars. Sand Trooper. Got to have a Sand Trooper in the collection. The original Star Wars A New Hope. So he's pretty cool. Very, Very good. Cool. So that looks That's like we've completed Aussie. Aussie. Now we do like ordering from Aussie because we do, do get, get the pop protectors. The pop protectors included. Oh, it saves us a couple of dollars every time. Yeah, because so. they're like two dollars each normally, yeah. aren't they? So yeah. they're really cool. So next we'll move on to Zing. Zing. Here so it this is. is the first Zing box. Now we did order two shipments from Zing because. As we were shopping, we were noticing things are already going out of stock on other sites. So we quickly rushed over um, to Zing because generally people don't go to Zing straight away because Zing doesn't offer free shipping. So people will go to Pop Culture and Aussie Collectibles first um, to get the free shipping to order over $100. So we rushed over to Zing and we managed. Oh my god, this is so cool! I'll let you show We that nearly one. reset. This was sold out everywhere. And I so wanted this. And it is Kevin with the Up House. That is the best pop ever. That is cool. Pop. Don't know where we're putting it. That's big. Oh my really gosh. Really big. Check out Kevin. How cool is that pop vinyl? Wow. It's bigger than all the other um, houses. And pop vinyl. It's almost like a dollhouse. Yeah. So big. Wow. That is awesome. I think you're going to have to get out <laughs> up and watch that. And we did manage to Carl and Ellie from, um, was it Emerald City Comic Con? Yeah, it might have been. Was it Emerald City or was it San Diego? One of them. It was the last one we did. San Diego. San Diego Comic Con. Yeah. We managed to get Carl and Ellie. We still need to though track down Russell, I think, from Russell. The yeah. um, original wave. So yeah. wow, so excited. Oh, I love the detail. Look how they even had the bottle cap for the number. Yes. You know, good. a lot of people may not notice that, but we do love our boxes. The artwork on the boxes is brilliant. I do display my pop vinyls in their boxes, so loving this pop vinyl, wow. So here's our second box from Zing. This was another one that we were finding was selling out on other sites. So again, rushing over to Zing, didn't worry about having to pay postage. I think it cost us $5.95 to get the up one shipped, that's and then pop. this one cost $6.95, which I don't understand. I think that's a bigger box. Because the other one was bigger. I think these might be Andrew's pop vinyls. We have Blunt Man and Chronic. Also known as Jay and Silent Bob. Bob. We love Kevin Smith and Jason Mewes. Oh, that they back. are awesome. I like all these movies. And don't forget the new movie coming out. Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back Part 2. And the next one <laughs> is... Oh, it's Madame Maxine from... Can't get it out. Harry Potter. This was another one that definitely was selling out. There we go, that made it easy. There we go. That's a cool pop too. Again, I thought they would have had that out a long time ago. And the first one is my favourite movie. Yay, so just one more box, one to, more go. box to go. And this one is from Pop Culture. I think there are still a few pop vinyls Andrew wants to get. Um, but they weren't like I'll do his one. faves. Um, the Dark Crystal? Dark Crystal ones. And HR Puff and stuff and all those characters. I think Witchy Boo's out. So. Oh we have some cool pops. Okay. From Wacky Races, we have Professor Pat Pending. I've been getting all the Wacky Races one. I used to love that show. I used to watch it when I was a kid also. I actually like the sticker on this one. You got a little it's nice. Statue of Liberty. 
Is that Freddy Funko? Is the statue? Or is it just a pop? It is probably Freddy Franco. Oh. And we have this one for Andrew, and this is the Mandalorian. Can't wait for the show, can't wait for the Disney streaming service. That will be watched the first night we have it, guaranteed. Wait a darling. It's a surprise one in here for Andrew that he didn't know I'd ordered. Oh, it's the purple flock Scooby Doo, and I didn't know that was on the way. Thank you, darling. Not a New I'm York Comic Con. But I love it all the all the same. We have just come back from Movie World and stuff, so... Oh, Scooby-Doo's great. And you're still in the Warner Brothers mood. Some info on the back. <coughs> I'll let Excuse you do this me. one, darling, because this one is probably your prized possession. Okay. And this also is at New York Comic Con, but I've been wanting a pop vinyl of Mr. Pinocchio for a long time. And this one's so cool, because you've got Jiminy Cricket sitting on his nose, because he's been a bad little puppet, and he's been lying. And that is my favourite Disney movie, people. Very cool pop. I love the dark tone. It's the second ever. It doesn't get as much love as it should. And the childhood memories from that movie are amazing. Another Wacky Races one, Clyde. I used to like Clyde. He was one of my favorite characters. So I think I have, what, six now? Wacky Races, seven Wacky Races? Yeah, something like that, yeah. Um, and the last one, you can do that one. We have, it's, there was a deal on Pop Culture. Um, if we bought, there was a three pack, we pretty much got one for free out of the three pack. So, and that was Emerald City, that one. This one, yeah, this is Emerald City. So I managed to get Andrew also the green chrome Boba Fett, which he doesn't own. No, I don't know. Thank you. It's very cool. I do own the other chrome Boba Fett from uh, Star Wars Celebration, the gold one. But I do want the blue one. But I know it's like 200 plus. Anybody out there wants to trade? <laughs> or just tease below. him. Or, yeah, or just tease me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, all, I'm all for that because I would do that. So, <laughs> so there you have it, guys. That's so our loot. A loot. A yes. haul. A haul. I've been excited for that for weeks. I'm very happy. Thank you for the surprise ones in there because I didn't know about it. It's a great selection brought out this year. Hopefully, I can track down that Mickey Mouse. I think he's only. How much is he limited to? Um, 1500 Fifteen hundred. Yeah. So he might be hard, but you know what? Hopefully Aussie, because Aussie are normally the ones who get us the, the super one. rare exclusives. Mm -hmm. um, so I do check every day. So if you're out there, Aussie, please, please, please bring Mickey Mouse onto the site. Yes. And you can have our money. Yes, you can have our money. <laughs> of course you can. Um, yeah, I've been considering Chrome Dumbo. It is on the website oh. for 1100 Maybe. But pull the trigger on such an expensive pop. <laughs> yeah, it's we fair. want it, but... <laughs> yeah. We haven't won lottery yet. <laughs> no, no. Thanks for watching, guys. Until next time. Happy, happy collecting. collecting! Bye!